In this social networking traffic video, we're going to be looking at 43things.com. It's the number four, the number three, and then things, T-H-I-N-G-S dot com, 43things.com. Now, this is a little bit of a different approach to the social traffic, but it's a way to combine two different goals in the same process. You can list your goals, you can share your progress, and you can cheer other people on. The idea of 43 things is to make a list of things, get to the stage of 43 things, and to actually complete them. And then as you go along each day, uh, much like Twitter, where you can put little posts, you can put in more comments, and actually tell people what you've achieved or what things you're doing. As you can say here, you can start making a list. If you need inspiration, there's different things that people have, like popular goals, um, health, money and wealth, spiritual and belief. There's all sorts of things in here. But the whole idea of 43 things is to actually make a list. So it's here like 43 things is the world's most popular online goal setting community. It's free to join. It's fun. And it tells you here how it works. So basically, you list your goals where you discover and list goals, what you want to do with your life. Um, you record your progress by tracking your progress by writing entries asking questions and talk with people who share similar goals this is the key to the traffic part here step one cheer people along another one great one encouraging others uh, as you may well know in life the more you encourage other people the more you get back yourself get started and uh, making a practice of listing goals and creating an account so as it says here most people never make a list of their goals and most never achieve them people who make a list um, actually live rich your lives are more likely to achieve them if you've done any self motivation self help or anything that's related to building your business and success even on the internet one thing you'll realize is that by listing your goals you'll find making and getting results a lot easier so that would be step one and then the next stage would be that you would um, write about your progress so you, when you reflect on your goals you actually gain focus and momentum so you start making comments about what it is you're doing and how you're getting on and this can be related to niche markets as well so you can make this traffic related if you want to um, but also by actually having this as a real goal setting site for yourself because it's on the web and other people can read it you're far more likely to keep pushing yourself forward to achieve which by itself is going to attract traffic and other people who will appreciate the fact that you're achieving what you're setting out to do and here you can cheer other people on it's a way of showing your support for other people on the 43things.com you can cheer their goals their entries their comments and pictures they've put up that inspire you and you might find that people start to follow along and cheer you back if you integrate this with perhaps twitter and facebook and show people what you're doing you're likely to get a following building very quickly even sites like myspace so how do you get started it's very simple once you've gone through the, the the list of the different stages or you can just sign up from the home page you start to make a list of your own so practice making a life list you'll be able to save and print it when you're done if you want to or you can just sign up for an account it's entirely up to you so you want to go through um, setting up um, things here of what you want to do for your life and if you need some help you can go looking at some of these tabs to perhaps get some inspiration and if you just click one of the tabs here you'll see a the box will like drop down a menu a sub menu showing you the different things that people are creating as life goals now this is where you can start to see already potential niche marketing um, research that you can be doing because if these are your own goals or you're able to create a site about them or write about them that will be a potential way of getting people to your websites once you start setting these as goals so this is a good way of doing research as well what is it that inspire others and what is it that people are looking for and do you share some of these as a common niche market that you could be setting up as your own challenge and getting other people to your sites so here popular goals lose weight stop procrastination so we could add that to our list for example it's now added and there's 22,995 other people who want to do this now think about this in the potential terms of creating a website about stopping procrastination and the steps that you took how you achieved it um, just, just the things you can do to create and grow there's 22,000 nearly 23,000 people on this one site that potentially could be interested in your site and long term your product if you can show steps to succeeding just another thought for you to look at there so if we click for example money and wealth let's have a look at what we've got here people want to learn to save money that might be a great one to add or getting out of debt 
becoming financially independent, uh, winning the lottery, paying off student loans. These are very big subjects here. Um, becoming a millionaire, sticking to a budget, retiring early. So let's become financially independent. We'll add that to our list for a test. As you can see, there's 4,430 people in this one. And then if we go on to something like health, you'll probably find lose weight will be here. There it is. Lose weight is there again. Drink more water. Um, exercise regularly. Run a marathon. Get healthier. Get in shape. Quit smoking. Have a better posture. You can see the different types here. So let's put drink water, for example. That's probably going to be quite a high. There we go. 16,000 people want to drink more water. Um, it's known to give you, obviously, um, better health. And in long term, it helps you with your, your, your body and your, your system. Um, so drinking water is always recommended for everybody. So here already we've got just between these few groups, we've got over 40,000 people that share just these three things with us. Now we can either save this or we can print this. Um, or we can just go along and sign up. So let's just sign up for an account here and actually create an account at 43things.com. We want to put in our username, our email, our password, and then their um, capture code they've called the iExam, and hit create an account. Once you first hit that create page, it says that your email has not yet been verified. So before you go along and start actually editing your account and making your profile, it's best to log into your email account and actually verify your sign up to 43things.com. As you can see here, just logging into your email account, you'll see that you have the confirmation email from 43things. You just need to click the link and go through to confirm your sign up at the site. It then says that your email address has been verified and asks, would you like to go to your list? So we can click to go to our list and start entering information on our site. So we can say things that we're doing, um, things that I'm doing at the moment, your first goal perhaps. And then you can see the things that you've done. Uh, you can see how many cheers available you have so you can cheer other people on. And you're limited to five to start with and that will grow the more you do. And as you can see here, you can things that you want to do and you can add it to your list of things to do and you can look through here for inspiration so for example if we wanted to perhaps start stop procrastinating we could click that and straight away it will pull up a page which shows us people that are actually doing this we can see there's 23,015 people who want to do this people doing this and their name and we can click and go see their profile. So this is how we can build up people coming to our profile. Um, you can see here tags that are related to procrastinating. If you want to do this and add it to your list, you can click the green button. If you've already done it, click you've done this. And that will let people know that you're already in that process. Uh, 560 out of 615 people think that this is worth doing. Um, people who've done this. So if people have actually achieved stopping procrastination, you can go along and actually look at their site. And then people doing this are also doing out other things. So they're trying out 43 things, waking up when the alarm clock goes off, be more efficient. And then you have entries. So you'll see people will actually show um, what they're actually doing to achieve this goal. And at this point, you can go along and cheer along this person. Uh, you can add comments to their comments. So this is a way to start getting your information into this site so that people can find you, link back to you and start processing and coming to your sites. And here you can see you can ask advice. You can get help from people who've accomplished this goal. You've got information here. And you can go through and read these as well and see the answers. Like, for example, someone said, how can I procrastinate less? And there's 12 people that have answered this question. As you can see here, if you think about this again, thinking outside the box, someone has posted here about getting help. How would you like to start a team? Would anyone like to join a team where we can share our to-do lists, what has been done, what remains? Maybe seeing it in print will help us, motivate us to get things done and then report back to the group. 38 people have responded to this. So for example, this person here said, yep, I want to do, where do we post? 
and the person who's posted it's replied back saying I sent you an invite to join the team so again here you could start creating a group of people who work with you peers or people that will follow you maybe if you're becoming an expert especially if you've achieved this for one of the 43 things so people see you as an authority because you managed to succeed and do it that would be a great way of building people to your niche so that was one way I'd recommend of getting people following you within 43things.com so for example if you were searching for this and you thought, saw someone who said they've actually done this listed and you click through to their profile you can go along and see what they've done and you can see their list they're here it's got 42 things that he's doing at the moment in time and he's managed to do 308 things so as you can see you just keep glow, growing and growing the great thing here is you can subscribe to this person's um, list of things they're doing so you can start getting people following you once they see that like, you've achieved something they might want to subscribe to your feed to see and follow you which is a great way of picking up followers within 43things.com and then on your about me section you can put your website so if someone wants to come through to your web page and again you could make these niche related you could make this your personal website your blog you can put this whatever you like here so again people once they come to your profile page can either subscribe to your feed or they can come visit your website. So a great way to make the best out of 43things.com. If you go back to your profile before you start adding things, what you're doing and what you've done, if you go to the customize section and click the link there, you'll be able to show add or remove widgets from your profile page and you can see examples of what these widgets are so you can have about you which adds your website your birthday etc website being key here you can show you and others your recent cheers you can add your photos from Flickr account if you want to you get some new goal suggestions from the magic eight ball you've got a morale track uh, a, a mor morale tracker you've got a personal challenge to so challenge yourself to complete one goal by a set date only one goal at a time so choose wisely this is a great one here so for example say you wanted to complete the 30-day challenge which happens every August or you wanted to stop procrastination you could maybe set that as your personal challenge and then keep going through the process until you've achieved it so it's a great way of goal setting for yourself and building followers to your sites and your profile recent activity you can show and then the 43 universe it links to your activity on 43 places 43 people um, a list of all of all bests and then your tag cloud describing how you've tagged your goals you can put that on as well and you can see examples of all of these just by clicking on the right hand side so say for example you wanted to see what an example of um, your tags would look like just hover over it you'll see here but it comes up for example 2007 resolution 2000 so however you tag different things you're doing will come up and obviously the more you put that tag and use it like any tag cloud the more bold and bigger it will show up inside the tag cloud and that's just how you can use it so that's how to get started with 43things.com use it to set up your profiles and start challenging yourself also networking with other people who are doing similar to you or people that maybe want to follow you once you've achieved them make sure you come back here and tick off that you've achieved it because successful people attract others and that is definite certainty that you can be using with 43things.com thanks for watching